My name is Mikhailo Babiak, and I play the French horn. <laughs> The name of the piece that I'm playing is the Interstellar Call from De Canyon aux Etoiles by Olivier Messiaen. It was written in the early 70s after he visited Bryce Canyon in Utah. He was an amateur, I'm not sure if he was an amateur or a professional ornithologist, but he had a very strong passion for birds and nature in general, but specifically birds. Um, and he was a devout, a devout religious uh, person. And, and he wrote this piece as a sort of meditation and offering to nature and to God or the gods, depending on how you interpret it. Um, and so there are quotes throughout. Some of the more technical passages are, are composed to remind the listener of uh, the Chinese thrush and the uh, canyon wren, uh, birds that, I don't know about the Chinese thrush, but the canyon wren certainly would have been flying around Bryce Canyon at the time. In addition to being this, this very meditative, peaceful, um, yet at times somewhat violent piece of music, it's an incredible showcase for the instrument. It shows off all the extended techniques, range, uh, you know, you can't ask for a more complete composition for the instrument. And certainly recording it in a space like this uh, really highlights everything that Messiaen uh, intended. I would say that music as an inner exploration really only started to cross my mind recently. Um, we spend so much time in school practicing and trying to play our solos and you know, getting ready for auditions and making sure that we're perfect. Um, and, and we can get to a point where we really start to resent practicing and it can be difficult. And I've certainly had those moments, you know, we, we struggle with it every day. Um, but especially lately, my practice time has really become a meditation for me and the performances have become an opportunity to share you know, what I'm learning and what I'm working on in the practice room. And I, I think it's important to have a good sense of what you're trying to say and what you feel um, in relation to the interpretation of a piece because you can't connect to the audience if you don't have something to say. Music has given me so many opportunities to meet people and see new places. I've, I've gotten to travel extensively around the world performing and learning and teaching and everything. And it's really made me realize how connected we all are. And music, I think, brings us together, unlike anything else, except for maybe, you know, a nice dinner and a bottle of wine, but there's always going to be music in the background, right?
And it also provides me with, with an outlet for self-expression. I love performing for people. Um, I love you know, seeing the look on a person's face walking out of the concert hall, happy that they attended that show, singing the tune of the last movement or whatnot. It just means that I did my job correctly and, and that makes me feel really good, knowing that, that people enjoyed the performance.